Böhringer Ingelheim has stood for innovation and responsibility for over 130 years. But how did it actually all begin? On July 31, 1885, Albert Böhringer purchases a small tartar factory in Ingelheim in southwest Germany. A few years later, he makes a groundbreaking discovery. Thanks to his innovative spirit, he finds a way of producing lactic acid in industrially relevant volumes using biotechnology, thereby making a lasting change to the market. Soon after, Albert Böhringer develops another pioneering business area. His company extracts alkaloids in order to supply them to pharmacies and the budding pharmaceutical industry. Based on these plant-derived active substances, he puts the first of his own drugs on the market, laying the foundation of today's core business. The next two decades are characterized by growth. New medications are launched for different indication areas, and new sites are built up. These include Biberach, in Germany's Upper Swabia, today still the company's largest research site worldwide. From 1948, Böhringer Ingelheim enters new territory and establishes its first subsidiary outside Germany. Many more follow. The company employs about 50,000 people worldwide by 2017. In the 1970s, Böhringer Ingelheim expands to the US market and establishes a new field of activity, animal health. Biotechnology is also expanded further, and the company's first biotechnologically produced drug for treating acute myocardial infarction is approved. Many more milestones follow. The transfer of HIV from mothers to their unborn children can now be prevented. A medication for the debilitating lung disease, COPD, is launched. For the first time in 50 years, anticoagulants with a completely new mode of action can be given. Böhringer Ingelheim successfully enters diabetes research and achieves an outstanding therapeutic success. In 2016, veterinary medicine is strengthened significantly. Through a swap of business areas with Sanofi, Böhringer Ingelheim becomes one of the world market leaders in animal health. And success will continue. The family-owned company will in future collaborate even more closely with startups and universities to support their research with development know-how and clinical studies. The Böhringer Ingelheim story is a classic example of true innovations. And the next innovation is surely on its way.